What's up everybody? It's Live Life Right. Welcome to the channel. Today I got a whole lot of topics to discuss. I will be discussing Jada and Will and all. <laughs> also Michael Blackson and Kiki Palmer and 50 Cent. So let's get right into it. Before I start, I need you guys to subscribe to this channel if you have not already. All right. Okay, we're going to start this video off with 50 Cent. I won't be talking a lot about him because in my previous video, I did a lot of commentary on him, Lil Wayne, and Regine. So guys, please check that out. I will put that in a video up so you guys can see it right after this video. So what I will talk about is that 50 Cent only fights with black people. And guess what? I was right. He threw, TMZ reported how he threw a table at a black a black male i don't know if he was a rapper or not but he threw a table at him i think he was trying to do music but 50 cent got angry and threw a table at him and was saying that you don't come at me like that and then there's another story that broke out that 50 cent got into it with another haitian rapper and once again guys he calling black women angry but he is an angry black man himself and it just proves my point and like i said please go check out my previous video because i'm not going to go in to all of that but i just want to make this point is that there's no growth from 50 cent and his behavior speaks for itself next next up i'm going to speak about august and kiki palmer he says some things back to her on twitter and somebody tweeted her and this is what she said and i'm going to read it she said yes girl august was never my man lol that's why you're still reaching to this day figuring out nothing whoa just wrote back to her and said you are obviously right i was never your man you could possibly never shorty Ooh, it seems you meant you got curved wow but your friends are the reason for that they showed me an endless thread of text, pictures of me that you sent worry about who I date and beg. Me to not no father disturb your mental instability. Okay, child. Whoa. So it got messy, y'all, on Twitter. And I'm going to read some more that he said. Imagine not knowing how to mind the business that pay you. I catch all the subliminals, not just about today, and you can call me whatever you like. Mess is constantly inserted. Yourself and topics you have none to do with. Go play with your mammy, not me. Oh, if you have something to say, say it with your chest, kids. It's always very perplexing because I, real deal, be showing genuine love whole time the envy eating your little heart anyways next no i'm lyrically not i'm actually messed with kiki so to see her covertly speaking subliminal shade around my name over the past week is deeply perplexed i don't and never had a problem with the girl it's always been virgo love so to see that is a mind mess to me Kiki Palmer tucked to Instagram to address this. I couldn't find it on Instagram, but this is from E! E! Entertainment Blog. She said, I want to be mean, but I can't. I want to post screenshots, but I won't. I feel attacked, but it's not about me. It's about so much more than that. And as much as I want to defend myself against the disrespect I have received, because I mean, I'm not nice all the time, this is about something much bigger, much bigger, she expressed on Instagram. Wouldn't feel good kicking someone when they are down because it's so easy to attack when you're in a corner. I get it. People be hurting y'all and most of the time it has nothing to do with you. Her message continued. I can't mess with my karma. Worried about my ego. Though I'm human and I have one. Just know I am that girl despite what my immunity may make one to believe. Allegedly, it was rumors that the two have dated far as back as 2015. Okay, I gotta move on, guys. But I do want to say this, that a lot of people are saying that August is taking all his anger out on Kiki because when Jada and Will went to the red table to discuss what happened. So my thoughts on that is that that wasn't really cool. And when he said play with your mammy that wasn't really nice either at all but i'm gonna keep it moving 
Friday's episode of Red Table Talk on Facebook Watch, the actress sit down with her husband Will Smith and open up to him about everything. Why Jada originally denied she was romantically involved with August, she confirmed on this show that it was indeed true. On the red table, Jada explained her in August. She called him Alt a lot in the interview. Sounds like a pet name, right? But she was saying that her and August both got into an entanglement. So I'm going to kind of read a little bit from the interview. About four and a half years ago, I started a friendship with August said Jada. We actually became really, really good friends. It all started with him just needing some help. Me wanted to help his health, his mental state, she explained. Jada said, we decided that we are going to separate for a period of time. Will said, you go figure out to make yourself happy and I'll go figure out how to make myself happy. I really felt like we could be over. The one thing I say about you and I is that there has never been secrets, said Jada, to which he responded with, we come together young and we're both broken in our own ways to be able to make mistakes without the fear of losing your actual family is critical okay so here's my commentary with all of this i feel like jada um jada was made to look like let's see the bad guy here and and it painted well to be this innocent person because he was sitting there looking pitiful it did look like he had teary teary eyes or whatnot but it's to me i feel like it is since he is the bigger star, you know, actor, he gets, you know, paid more for his movies. I feel like they made his image more clean because let's let us let us keep it real. Will has cheated a lot in the past, a lot. And there's just rumors going around um, of him helping a YouTube girl and he's going on vacations with other other young girls and he takes care of them that rumor has been going around and so i feel like since jada is you know she's an actress but she doesn't make the money like will does she took on this responsibility however i'm not gonna hold jada um innocent either don't get me wrong i love the smith family have respect for them but they are a little bit strange and weird for my liking they are some strange people However, you know, I still still like them, but they are weird. We have to, we can't like fake, like fake it and say that they're not. Something is kind of strange there. But as I was saying that, even when he asked Jada to speak about when she called the affair entanglement, he was trying to say, call it what it is. And you can kind of see that Jada was about to catch an attitude and caught herself. So these two has been married for so many years. And no doubt, I think they were in love at the beginning. But maybe the two fell out of love. And it shows because she did say, and a lot of people is getting in on Jada because when they asked her about August years ago, she referred to him as her son, which is make it very, it makes it sick because now you're coming out and saying you two did have, you, you guys did have a relationship. He said they were in a relationship for three years. And, and a lot of sources are saying that he lived with her and he, she took care of him, you know, f- for those three years. So it's like, and that was Jading's friend first. This is kind of all weird. But what I feel that they did this interview to save Will's face. And like I said, both of them are not perfect. Like definitely Will is not. Because he told her in the interview, I feel like I need to get you back. And she said, you got me back plenty enough. But ever since this interview um, hit um, hit the scene on, on a social media, Facebook, a lot of people has, you know, people is crazy. One minute, you know, they're bashing them, right? But when she said entanglement, 
that word has really taken off and everybody has been making their own memes and it is funny you i can't lie and i know jada and will is laughing behind the scenes about that because it's funny jada you need to patent that name because people is about to make money off of that name and you did you know you made it popular hey you might want to go ahead and copyright it and patent it <laughs> but um and I want to speak on Michael Blackson. And so I'm gonna show the DM here and read that. Here is what Michael Blackson said to Will Smith on Instagram. He said, yo, my dude, Fresh Prince, you okay? Will said, yes, I'm cool. I appreciate your concern, my African Philly brother. Michael said, just making sure you didn't go back to drinking like you did in Hancock. <laughs> Will said, we broke up, so she did her and I did me. Mike, Michael said, I had a feeling you cried when you got in the house because entanglement sounds like they did some some stuff, my brother. Will said, WT8, I'm sorry, WTF, what you mean? And Michael said, well, entertainment is like a compromising and complicated position. I think, and you guys can read that part. And Will said, I'm blocking you now. That was very funny <laughs> but anyways i'm going to end this video with um i'm trying to think some last words i want to say about this jada situation well jada did say in the past her and tupac never had a fling going on so now with this going on i don't know if people is going to pretty much believe that either but you know what um you know i, I don't know what to say about this um like, I still like both of them, but I still think they are weird. And I wish she didn't say that that was her, like, he was like a son to her years ago. Because now it's just, it's it's really weird now. Because you guys did have a relationship. But you know what? That's all I'm going to say about that. Um, guys, let me know in the comment section what do you fell on all the topics I talked about from 50 Cent to Kiki Palmer, August, Jada Pickett, Will, even Michael Blackson. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Make sure you like, make sure you follow me all on social media. I'm on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. Please make sure to subscribe to my channel. I really would appreciate that. I have been on YouTube for a whole year. I had 322 subscribers, y'all. And YouTube took my channel down. So it's like I have to start all over from scratch. But this time I'm making sure I'm doing it right. And all my content belongs to me. Also, I have a brand new subscriber. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. I have three subscribers. I want to thank all three of you guys for subscribing to this channel. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.